Ziggurat, ziggurat, kadding dum dum, ziggurat, ziggurat, but I'm bong dum, ziggurat, ziggurat, kadding dum dum, ziggurat, 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 kadding dum, kadding dum, kadding dum, kadding dum. Okay, enough of that. Hello there. Welcome to Ziggurat. Uh, this is a game that is actually pretty fucking fantastic. I've been having a lot of fun with this. I can uh, describe it as something like a dungeon crawler, roguelike type wizard shooty game. If that interests you, then fucking stay tuned. There is an intro for this game, which I'm gonna play at the end of this intro, which is like an intro after an intro. And you can skip that if you want, it's just kind of explaining a bit of the backstory of what Ziggurat is. Uh, if you don't give a shit about that and you just want to see the gameplay, then stay tuned. We're gonna pick Kraz. Uh, I've been playing as this guy, I haven't tried Kraz out yet. But this is like the main character, he's like balanced, doesn't have anything really going for him. This guy, however, has a very powerful magic wand skills, but smaller mana pools for the other magic disciplines. So. I'll explain that in a minute when the game starts, but enjoy this intro for now and then we'll resume when the game actually starts. Tales and legends of the Grey Horn Citadel have managed to pass through the thorny forest and ruthless rock mountains, reaching the ears of everyone who appreciates a good story. The citadel has known the origin of the Daedalon Brood fucking hell, it's too fast. The power of these wizards is beyond doubt. Countless times they have proven their worth, protected these mystic lands from evil forces, always trying to fucking list. So fast, I can't read it. But today magic overflows with power since the is hosting an event every held once every ten winters. The elder masters have gathered all apprentices in a solemn ceremony prior to the final event, the entrance to the ziggurat. You are the one of these apprentices who have been studying arcane magic for twenty years from for this very time, yet the most exclusive and powerful server wizard ever known to become a Daedalon brother. Whew. Look at the ziggurat. Looks fantastic. A lot of levels there. Waddle is known of the test is told in whispers that come and go of the room, a slight feeling of uncertainty is in the air. There is only a certain about the ziggurat, but very few have managed to get out alive. It is told that failing the test is a fate worse than death, a punishment for defying the ancient horrors. In a way, this is also an attempt to keep the fearsome dark forces at bay, offering the souls of talented novices as sacrifices. You take a look at my room and lines, every penis, morals, and morals, and well, look at my cape. It's fucking gigantic. Upon reaching the entrance, you can't avoid a shiver. All your senses are warning you of danger awaiting inside. But this is not the time for doubts. Hesitation will only make it something. I didn't see that. Firmly grasp your magic wand. Well, giggity, and enter the obscure structure with fucking... Ziggurat. Alright, so here we are in the game. You can see the, uh... Controls there on the left to just shoot an alternate attack. So you got like a Oh my god, it's like a machine gun. And then you got like a pretty much like a shotgun there The eye of twilight. What's this one do? Oh god, okay Holy shit, it's like two machine guns I have here. This is awesome So as you can see there on the right side of the screen, you got your purple uh, Mana pool and then you got the green little bar there. The green bar is for this staff. So when I use this staff um, which you'll see in a minute. These filthy skulls. It goes down there. Oh my god, I fucking hate these carrots. But, um, the first few levels shouldn't be that difficult, actually. I got this awesome, like, machine gun. How can I lose? So the things I'm picking up here is, like, experience and mana. Holy shit. The kamikaze skull, I like to call him. The yellow ones are... The yellow ones are experience, and the green ones kind of refill my mana pool. Hello there. Goodbye. Uh, the thing I like about this game is you think like wizardry and all this, it wouldn't be that kind of fast paced and have you have to aim and stuff. Oh my god, is he gonna disappear? I'm like a little kid, man. The guy looked like uh, the airbender, didn't he, in that photo? I'm like the little airbender. Oh, careful those spikes. So, hiccups, hold your breath. What does this mean? It looks like poison gas in the middle there, doesn't it? Let's coin all these skulls together. I think this is just an entire level of skulls, isn't it? I'm gonna coin them all into like one area and then destroy them all. This one's green, I should try and kill him first. Okay, here we go. Oh god. Hello. Fuck you. Die. Here we go, maybe we can use this. Oh no, I tried to switch to this one. Oh god, I'm missing them all. Here we go. Nah, it's not really effective. I should just... 
<laughs> I mean, my my this staff is so powerful anyway. I don't need to rely on the other staffs. Here we go. Oh god. I seem to be lagging quite a bit with the recording. I'm not sure why. It says I'm at 90 FPS, but I'm getting a bit of recording lag. So if you're seeing a bit of stuttering, I apologize. Other than that, it should be quite smooth. So there we go, we've managed to dispatch of all the nasty skulls and we leveled up. So when you level up, you get to choose an upgrade, which is kind of cool. Uh, they give you a choice of two things. Mana gems give you more magic energy, or you can increase your staff mana pool. Well, I do have lower mana pools because of my character choice. So let's go with an increased mana pool. And it looks like we're in an area that splits off into one, two, three, four, five different rooms. God damn it. So actually the point of each level is you got to find a portal key and the portal key will uh this is the boss room okay you need the portal key for the boss room and the portal key will like summon the boss of the level so you can't kind of find the boss room defeat the boss and then exit the level you have to actually look for the portal key which is kind of cool i guess so here we go we've got more minions to deal with break some barrels oh god ow 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 what is shooting at me Got these fucking... Okay, and we got skulls as well. Die, bitch! I fucking hate them, they're so hard to hit. These things as well. Got some good drops from them though. I saw some health. There we go, as I fucking get fucked. Okay, let's just try and kill the rest of them. Oh my god, there's more skulls. Did I just pick up another health thing? I'm not losing that much health. I'm not I'm not that concerned with this. Fucking die, bitches! Oh, bang! Is the last one? No, we got a nice skull there as well. Brilliant. And replenish all our health. Oh no, there's still... Still mean- oh god, fucking hell. Did not see them. <laughs> I swear to god, I thought I finished that. Alright. I don't think the portal key will be the in this room over here. Seems a bit too close to... Seems a bit too close to the... No, this is, this is a trap room. Okay. Um... Oh, I forgot to mention there was a sprint button. Oh god. Shift makes you sprint. Okay, we get an item here? I think this might be an upgrade. Uh, golden amulet, right. Doubles alchemy attack rate for some time. Don't know what that means. We press E to use the amulet. That's all I know. Alright, that seems a bit worth our time. Fantastic, let's get out of here. We'll go back to the room with five en exits or entrances, whatever you call it. Like, every level is actually pretty damn big. I mean, this is just the first level, mind you. I don't know how many uh, levels there are. Interesting to find out, see how far I can get. I've only managed to get as far as level 3 so far, which kind of sucks. I need to f and you get a you get a different weapon for every level that you complete. I'll try and kill the funguses because they're fucking they're the worst to deal with. Okay. Boom. Like uh my mana actually replenishes quite quickly. Jump over this. Oh my god, he's fucked up. I don't care about him. I need to kill this thing first. He's more dangerous. I'm not too concerned with the skulls. And we've got funguses here. Brilliant. Fantastic. Anything else I can say to tell you how great that was? No. I'm at 100 health, this is good. We haven't found the room. Oh, level 3! What a nice surprise. Mana gems give you more magic energy. Show you one more perk when leveling up. Hmm. Let's go with that. That sounds good. More choice is always good, right? Oh, there's nothing over here. Okay. <laughs> I don't like his, his, uh, <laughs> the way he screams like that. Alright. Looks like, uh, the only way is, is south, right? Yeah, we've explored up there. It must be down here somewhere. God damn it. It's so large. That's what she said. Oh, here we go. It's right here. Brilliant. Got the portal key. Um, I do actually want to... Oh, God. Fucking... <laughs> but I missed that. 
Well, not concentrating. I want to go back and go and explore a bit south first. There might be some interesting shit there. And I'm at kind of full everything, so I shouldn't really be worried about wasting a bit of time. Is that a skeleton? Oh dear. Just one skeleton hanging out in this room. I wonder what happened to him. Poor guy. What's in here then? It's a large fucking room. What minions are we dealing with here? Oh, these guys? These guys are shit. We just got little crossbows. These guys, however. Oh! That was a one hit kill. Boom! Man, this guy really has a powerful staff. Even though it always run out of mana. Speak of the devil. But it recharges really quickly. I'm back to 70. Hui! Die! Eat shit! So is there anything in this room? No, I just got a bit of XP. Okay. And the moon's up there. Lovely. Oh, magic mushrooms. Not right now. I got a job to do. I got the ziggurat to conquer. Hui. 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 So this is where I spawned, right? Is it? Yeah, it is. So there's an entire different way over here. Oh, fucking treasure room. What's this? <gasps> Whoa, what's happening? Oh. Okay, it's one way to open a chest. What the fuck is this? Alchemy pouch. Increase your alchemy in mana pool. Alright. Get a free perk. Oh. Should have come here in the first place. <laughs> Went the wrong way. Alright, so we can go attack the boss now. Which will be... I bet you're all fucking excited for that, aren't you? Quivering in your little trousers. Uh, what? Okay, never mind. He's right in here. And I summon you! King Blob, the majestic slime. The thing is, right, these bosses... They seem to summon a lot of uh, minions, but if you just attack the actual boss... God, I'm not doing a good job of avoiding his attacks, am I? If you just kill the boss like that, all of them die. <laughs> Look how easy that was. It's mental, isn't it? I think they should actually make the uh, minions, like, not be able to die after you kill the uh, guy. Potions give you more health. Your speed is heavily increased for a while when hit. Oh, I'm going to go with this, I think. That could be really uh, useful, actually. And we're going to go on to uh, level 2. Let's go. I think we get a little, uh, like, upgrade. Uh, no, up not upgrade. A uh, thing that tells you what you've done. Enemies killed. Items picked up. Total 131. Alright then. Let's go on to level 2.